everybody good evening good evening um we are welcome to tonight's prayer this is saturday night 10 p.m gmt plus one and we do this every week um every saturday we are live and we are praying you know we pray for our lives we pray for the nations we pray for the church and in tonight's episode of prayer we are going to be standing as watchmen over the nations of um, ukraine and russia you know for quite some time now we've been hearing of the ongoing um conflict between the two nations so we are going to be interceding for these two nations and you know i'm, I'm praying that the will of god be established in in the land do you understand because we must come to the point of realization that god has set us as watchmen you know god has empowered us to be able to to um um um, um to pray for nations he has empowered his church to be the mediator to be the mediating um, um agency you know for land to be the uh the intercessor for land you know the scripture was in the book of mark chapter 11 around verse 17 when jesus came to jerusalem and entered the temple and he saw them buying and selling you know he made a statement that is very profound and instructive for the church he says is um is it not written is it not written has it not been written have you not read has it not been declared by god he said that my temple or my house shall be called the house of prayer for all nations do you understand he was saying that um um um, um it is the, the the will of the father the way the, the the way that god has structured it he structured the church you know to be the 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 the, the, the platform through which the nations are are rescued so he said that my house shall be called the house of prayer for all nations it means that from the house of god prayers would arise for the salvation of the nations for the saving of the nations so the church is is, is the entity that god has established that means that if the church does not pray the nations will spiral into destruction the 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 conflicts between nations would continue the hidden will, will continue to reign in the nations but jesus was saying that the structure of god is that through the church and through the prayers of the church you know the nations will be saved so he was anchored in the spirit and he said is it not written that my temple that my house will be called the house of prayer for all nations but look at what you've turned it into so um, um we have left the mandate of god upon the church and we are chasing shadows you know in some places we are chasing shadows things that don't matter in eternity you know as the church we are meant to rise as a force and agree in prayer over the nations and say lord we are establishing your counsel over this nation we are establishing your will he said and i sought for a man i sought for a man god is always seeking for a people that was stand in the gap that will stand in the gap for the nations that will stand in the gap and say we stop the 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 flow of iniquity in this land we stop the flow of the the, the operation of darkness in this land we stop the flow we stop the flow god is looking for such men uh, who will hold on to the horns of the altar for the the saving of the nations uh, for the salvation of the nations and tonight we have come uh, that the holy ghost who oh we take a hold of us um, as we go in this journey of intercession uh, oh we are yielding ourselves uh, we are yielding our our voices uh, we are yielding our spirit uh, unto the holy ghost uh, so that he can ride upon us so that he can ride upon us uh, he can ride upon us tonight uh, oh for the saving of the nations uh, jesus we don't know what to pray for as we ought but the holy ghost make it intercessions uh, together with us with groanings that cannot be uttered uh, oh holy ghost help us tonight uh, can you just lift up your voice and begin to worship the name of the father be begin to say thank you lord uh, oh for bringing me into your 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 yourself uh, oh for making me acceptable in the beloved uh, because if we are not acceptable in the beloved we cannot stand uh, and watch over nations uh, we cannot stand uh, and legislate over the nations uh, but because god has brought us into himself uh, we are able to uh, 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 to establish the counsel of the lord uh, upon the nations uh, can you begin to say lord i thank you 
for you are great and you are greatly to be praised and so ten the manons get the penta reconzi de vente ne mana gaido zi veleta reten de ben don jen de gete ha regate gete manan don jen de ringa balata regate la baba bande zi veleta ha jesus we thank you ha oh we thank you we thank you for your salvation ha oh jibi de vente ke ben de leta ha regate de ten don zi ne pele gadan de lu kredisha ha reconzi le ten na malata ha oh je de 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 manan na mama ma Recombele den jende runza baram de radha Errege de mele non zande bene kando den brede radha Errege de bele ne mene mene mele naha Jege de rem dono ha E zai no man de ge den do ro provolata Oh Jesus we give you the praise ha Jesus we give you the glory ha Erri sono mananga deja ha Erre sunte bene tande ge te ha Erre sunte mene tali agata ha Errege de nanosa for you reign and you rule even in the affairs of men, you reign and you rule. Even in the affairs of men, you are the all-sufficient God. You are the only wise God. You are the beginning. You are the end. You are the maker of the whole universe. Every nation, every country was created by you. Oh, masuntene menga bela, resunde kete na maladunjeta. You are the creator of the whole universe. You are the maker of the whole universe. The earth is yours and the fullness thereof the world and all that dwell therein the earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof the world and all that dwell therein it means that every people every tribe every nation every language they take their origin from God therefore if they took their origin from God, then they have to listen to God. Ah, can we thank God? Oh, Jekabalate, Resunte Getalia, for he sits upon the nations. Resunte Gependa Lagua, Reco Presive Leta, Jinikitila Barahande Siefaha. In the name of Jesus, we have worshipped. Now, um, um, he says the earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof. You know, there are some understandings that you need to have so that we can, um, you know, as we legislate tonight we will legislate from a point of knowledge from a point of light from a point of confidence he says the earth is the lord's and the fullness thereof the world and all that dwell therein it means that every person every language every tribe every nation you know the belonger to the lord therefore when we come as intercessors and we are declaring the the, the word of the lord over the nations they have no option than to listen because they originate Originated from God, their origin, their source is God. Their source is God. That means they 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 they, they must listen to the word. They must listen to the voice of God. Oh Jesus, we thank you. In the name of Jesus, we have worshipped. Amen. Now we'll be starting by dealing with the spiritual forces that are in, that are involved in this conflict. You know, the deception of the enemy is to make us believe that it is only the things that we are seeing physical that is that is what is obtainable. No. But the enemy, oh, Kadadansha, that is why the Apostle Paul said one, in one of the letters, he said, for we are not ignorant of the devices of the enemy. We are not ignorant of how the enemy operates. So he wants to hide behind the scene and, you know, things are happening physically and you, you are like, ah, and you are, your mind does not even go to the fact that this is the operation of darkness. So when when the, 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 the army came against um, Elisha, he made the prayer and said, Lord, open the eyes of my servant so that he will see into the realm of the spirit. And when the eyes of the servant was opened, he saw that they that were with Elisha were much, much more bigger than what he was seeing physically. That was just on the side of, of the good. So had it been, had it been the eyes of the servant of Elisha was not opened, he, all he will be seeing will be the physical army, you know, coming against Elisha. And then when, when the, 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 the army was, um, is, is struck um, blind, he, all he will be seeing is Elisha and he will be like, Elisha, oh, we are a powerful man. Not knowing that behind the scene, this is a warfare between, you know, light and darkness. 
So had it been his eyes was also opened into the realm of into the dark realm, he would have seen demons, you know, sponsoring the army, the Assyrian army. Do you understand? So behind the scene, behind the scene, um, um, behind the curtains, there are spiritual forces that are orchestrating the, the events of the world. They are orchestrating the events of nations. And for us to gain control, we must gain control in the spirit realm. So no matter the, the, the activities we do on, on, on the surface of the earth physically, if we don't deal with it from the roots, it will not it, it cannot be sustainable so that was why when god called unto gideon the first thing he told him was go and destroy the altar in your father's house that was a spiritual he was telling him dissociate yourself you know from these dark spirits destroy the operation of these dark spirits in your family and in your life and then you can come and then we'll, i will use you physically do you understand so we are going to be praying and the, the scripture says that whatsoever my father has not planted they say they will be uprooted do you understand he said whatsoever you bind on earth shall be bound in heaven so we are going to be lifting up our voices and proclaiming judgment over the, 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 the spiritual forces of wickedness sponsoring the, the conflict between Ukraine and uh, Russia. In the name of Jesus, God said, uh, and I will bring judgment upon the gods of Egypt. Uh, ah, and at, at, uh, you know, when God brought that judgment upon the gods of Egypt, Israel was delivered. So we are going to be praying that the judgment of the Lord will come upon every spiritual enemy entity that is sponsoring this conflict in the name of jesus we judge you by the blood of the lama we stop your operations every planting of the enemy we uproot right now Rusayina Atonaha Jegegetune Ekuba Ante Rus and Terigadaga will bind your operations right now in the name of Jesus. We'll bind your operations right now. Resaino Manata Ragada Bandes Kotobeleta Radada Bobaha and Jegegontonomaha Reproveleta and Tomante Kaindon Seino Baravisaha Ereco Palatonsia Resulene Menemandon Sene Manata in the name of jesus you know something is just coming into my spirit uh, you know is it is that if the devil wants you to believe that it's just only about ukraine and russia no but what i'm sensing in my spirit is that there is a there is a long-term plan of the enemy do you understand it's starting with ukraine and russia but i'm telling you that if nothing is done this this conflict will spiral into other nations it will spiral into other nations if God does not intervene. If God does not intervene, Cardantus Gepelataha, Jecote Neparasivele Tande Kubeletaha, Resunia, there is the bigger picture in the eyes of the devil. Resune Po, we rise up as intercessors, we rise up as watchmen, and we declare tonight in the name of Jesus, the operation of darkness is stopped. Lesuti. Keto namba e resusi gagadi rosaina mamata le kutune kayaga resole pala rosaino penos into guate recopendos alata in the name of Jesus over these two nations over these two territories ah jenepe I raise up a standard by the Holy Ghost against recutele kwa melenoja resusi de ketenida. Against the operation of darkness 
in the name of Jesus. Oh, Jenemeneba, Ragadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadadad
Bene Bene Kabamati Koto Bene Rasino Bene Manamana Jekete Kete Manama Mes Loda Mes Loda Resaina Mamanda Seno Gombanande Raseno Babakwa Lakada Mes Loda Resada Bagada Have mercy, O God. Mercy, Lord. Mercy, Lord. Mercy, Lord. Mercy, Lord. Oh, Jesus. Mercy, Lord. By your blood. By your blood, we plead for mercy. Mercy. Mercy over Ukraine. Mercy over Russia. Mercy, Lord. 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 Have mercy. Have mercy. Have mercy, have mercy, have mercy, mercy, Lord. In the name of Jesus, we have prayed. Amen. Finally, we're praying from the book of Psalm chapter 2. Just one prayer point, Psalm chapter 2. We'll be enacting the will of God. Psalm chapter 2, from verse 1, it says, Why do the hidden rage and the people imagine a vain thing? He said, the kings of the earth set themselves and the rulers take counsel together against the Lord and against his anointed, saying, let us break their bands asunder and cast away their cords from us. Then verse 4 says, he that seated upon in the heavens shall love. Now, the, the counsel that the kings of the world they are taking together is that they would break off from the rulership of Yahweh. They will break off from the will, from the from the from the counsel of God, from the will of the Father. So they are saying we don't want the will of God to prevail in our nations. So that is the the, the summary of their of their counsel. Say let us break the calls, the bands of the Lord and of His anointed from off our back, from from off from off our necks. Let us cast off his yokes. So they are trying to, to, to make sure that the will of God is not established in their system. That the will of God is not established in the nations. But we are the ones. It was Jesus. He says, in this manner, pray. He says, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. So as the realm of darkness is working to make sure that the will of God is not done in the nations. Jesus is saying that we are the ones that would enforce the will of God upon the nations. And so tonight, I want you to begin to declare that the will of the Lord is made manifest in the nations of Ukraine and Russia and in the nations of the world, in the US, in Canada, in, 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 in Asian countries. In the name of Jesus, the will of the Lord, the will of the Lord. In African countries, in European countries, the will of the Lord. In North America, in South America, we are using Ukraine and Russia as a point of contact, but we are spreading the rulership of Yahweh. Resusigata in Beguntu Nekana, Resusetalia, that the kingdoms of this world will become the kingdom of our God and of our and of His Christ. In the name of Jesus, we establish the the will of God uh, in Ukraine. Uh, we establish uh, the will of God uh, upon the landscape of Russia. Resinamata. Let the will of God prevail uh, in Compena Salata. Resusegete Likwanaga. Jekanamantos Kebeleta. In the past, uh, the Lord has in, had intervened in, uh, in battles uh, between nations. Uh, Resusegada. Uh, and he will do the same also uh, in this one in the name of Jesus. Jesus, resaidan con tombenga, rosaida bagadentos camena, rescabalana senoko, jetada baba, in the nikaidos eco balata, resaina mababa baba, zesondoba, resaina manata, we stop the flow of akagandas cabalata, of darkness, we stop the flow of violence, we stop the flow, erisco banguanata, and set that the will of God be established that the will of God be established the mandate of God be established the mandate of God be established in the name of Jesus the mandate of God be established 
in the name of jesus we have prayed amen and amen god bless you for joining tonight and i want to um beseech you to continue praying for these two nations to continue praying that the peace of the lord will flow over this land in the name of jesus we are the people god is looking for he we are the people he's he's banking on he's banking on us like his hope is in us his hope is in the church and we are saying lord we will not fail you in the name of jesus thank you very much god bless you and i proclaim over your your life your family your marriage your business in the name of jesus the hand of the lord i see the hand of the lord it comes upon you the hand of the lord comes upon your life in the name of jesus Ah, Jenananto Zesizele Kanamandish, Yekaila Barandish. As you have prayed for the nations of the earth, I declare the Lord turns the earth to favor you. In the name of, he say he is seated upon the circles of the earth. Therefore, he can rotate the earth to your favor. I declare that the Lord rotates the earth for your favor. In the name of Jesus, the earth rotates to favor you. In the name of Jesus, men arise to favor you. In the name of Jesus, systems arise to favor you. In the name of Jesus, beauty the Lord will give you in place of ashes. Honor in place of shame. In the name of Jesus, he will give you double honor. Double honor. The reign of his glory will fill your life, will fall upon you, and his glory will radiate through you. In the name of Jesus, the glory of the Lord, bringing prosperity, bringing peace of mind, bringing the right spouse, bringing the right marriage, comes. Ah, ya da da do she ka in suse la gandish. Zetuns enka ye gadisha le sunya. A name is coming to my heart. Ogechi, Ogechi, the Lord is saying, I am for you. I am with you. I am with you. I am for you. Your life will become a sign and a wonder. In the name of Jesus, hold on to me. Father Lord, we thank you. In the name of Jesus, we have prayed. Amen and amen. Thank you very much. God bless you. And do have a wonderful night. Rest. Bye. Mm-hmm.